we have found the most extraordinary sighting and I wonder if you've spotted it yet. There we go, just that little bit of movement. This is so unexpected, it's so late in the season. Look at this, brand new, still soaking wet. Look, it's still covered in the muck from its birth around the top of its back and its leg. Oh, little one. Welcome to the world. A brand, brand new buffalo calf. Isn't this just too special? Okay, little one, up you get. Up you get. Oh, it hasn't even worked out how to use its legs yet. But it's thirsty. Come on, Mum. Come on, Mum. You've got to encourage this little one up. There you go. Oh. Hello. There you go. Almost. Almost. Up a little bit. There's Mum. Mum is absolutely ancient. Sorry, that's not probably entirely fair. She probably doesn't appreciate that. But just look at her horns and her face. This is not a young buffalo cow. You can even see as she chews, you can even see the worn down state of her teeth. And she's done a phenomenal job of bringing this little baby into the world. Especially considering how little grass there is to eat. Most of the other buffalo have had their calves by now. She's had to finish off the final moments of gestation oh, with so little food. It's incredible what her body has put in to produce this little baby. There we go. Oh, almost. Come on. Up you get. A struggle as old as this area itself. There we go. Well done. Terribly wobbly little legs. Oh, lean against mom a little bit, lean against that tree. Oh, wow. This is so incredibly special. We've been looking for leopard cubs, but to see a baby buffalo take its first few wobbly steps. Oh, there you go, little one. No, no, that's not mom. That's not mom. That's a bull, little one. He's not going to appreciate that. No, no, he's really not going to appreciate that. No, no, that's... Oh, shame instincts kicking in. Just to let you know, for those of you who are sensitive, there is a very good chance that this male is going to lose patience with this baby very shortly. And I've seen it before, where it's been, where a young buffalo calf that's made this mistake has been kicked and trampled upon. So just be aware that that is a possibility, because at the moment, this little buffalo calf has definitely not found mom. Oh, little one. Oh, oh, oh. Careful, you're going to get kicked. Oh, mm, here we go. All right. For those of you who are sensitive, now would be the time to look away from your screens. I'll tell you when you can look back. I think that might be over. Oh, it's a harsh world. I think that's all done. Oh, no. No, run, little one. Run, little one. Come on, boy. He just made a mistake. Just a baby. Just a mistake. Come on, Mom. Up you get. Shame, she's exhausted. Okay. The buffalo bull has turned away now, so for those of you who stopped watching, you can watch again. I'm not sure about whether that buffalo caused any injury to the calf, 
but it seems to be okay. It's on its feet. And now we need to hope that mom gets up so that this little calf starts feeding because it's hungry now. And that's why that happened. She moved away from the safety of the herd to give birth. Okay, little one. Shame. You can see its back's arched. Very unstable and very, very hungry. And in this chilly winter, oh, it's still wet. Mom needs to give it a good clean. I think because of her age and because of the drought, she's struggling in terms of energy. This has just taken it out of her. She can't quite bring herself to stand up. She's exhausted. Girl poor thing. She's had this calf so late. Most of the other buffalo calves, oh, oh. You might want to stop. Okay, that's okay. He's just lying down. I thought he was going to aim a kick at the calf. All right, little one. Here you go. Hello, little girl. It's a little female. I can gauge that just by the way that she's urinating. Oh, little one. And a sighting like this is both awe-inspiring and also a little bit terrifying. I'm really worried that the female is so exhausted that she's going to struggle to get up and feed the baby in the way that she needs to. She's very thin. She's not too thin though, she'll be okay. Come on girl. Come on, you can do it. I know you're tired, but your little baby needs some warmth and some food. On this chilly winter's morning, a tiny baby like this needs to get dry as quickly as possible and I don't think she's had the energy that she would under normal circumstances to actually lick it clean and dry which is why it's still sticky and as you know babies of any kind get cold very very quickly oh little one this is brand new this calf entered our world probably less than a couple of hours ago I would say in the last two hours or so. Shame. And that was pure instinct telling it to go looking for food between a buffalo's back legs. Unfortunately, not going to have any success with that male. And that little calf was lucky that that injury wasn't, or that response wasn't worse. It's okay, it's just your mom. That's just your mom. Imagine that, your first few hours of life and that is your first lesson. Life is incredibly tough for these amazing animals. Luckily, nature has made them equally as tough. That's a bird, little one. It's going to be sitting on your back in the future, helping you out. Shame. Already the flies settling down and the baby not yet used to the sensation. Oh. I know this is very difficult to look at and you must be wondering about this mother's response. Oh, little one, no, no, no. Don't go that way. Not that way. Of course, you're all wondering why the mom doesn't get up and help her baby out. I don't think she has the energy. Look at her hip bone there. Or at least the hock, the hock and the hip bone. She's just given birth. It might have been a particularly difficult birth. She's an old buffalo. It's drought, so she hasn't been able to feed herself properly. And I think she's just exhausted. She might even still be passing the placenta, which is also 
can't help but notice they seem a bit skittish. And what's happening?